Yeah, it's not your typical day here at Okinderhook. Uh, we, we certainly would love some uh, warmer weather here in the fall to get our fall golf. Uh, of course, is our, is our bread and butter here at Okinderhook. Um, we're a 750-acre uh, resort located just about five miles from the square in Camden, Missouri. Uh, so we're actually in the middle of a transition right now. We got, of course, a uh, golf season, uh, but we're getting ready to transition over to our ice rink over there behind us over there. So we open up the ice skating on Thanksgiving at 1 o'clock. And then we'll have all of our uh, Christmas festivities kicking off on Black Friday, the 29th, uh, every weekend leading up to uh, December 21st uh, weekend right there. We'll have horse-drawn carriage rides, Santa Claus, Mrs. Claus, games, uh, bonfires, s'mores. We do elf storytelling every Friday night for the kids with uh, cookies and milk. So it's your family-friendly uh, resort here in Lake of the Ozarks. And that's something you guys have been doing, what is this, five years now? You've had the Yeah. Is it so it's five years. Five years, yeah, five years. And uh, every year we open up a different time based on the weather as we, uh, as all based on Mother Nature. So uh, hopefully uh, we'll, we'll be geared up here and starting to make ice here in about another week and then uh, get our Zamboni fired up and uh, get ready for the season. You know, when you talk about unique uh, places to go to in, in the region, uh, you guys putting this ice rink in really uh, was a visionary movement in this area. Uh, I've seen... You know, I, I, I got to admit, I live pretty close to you guys. So I, I've seen people over the years come in from all over the area, uh, stay at the hotel, uh, you know, spend the whole weekend with the family. Like you said, do the carriage ride, uh, the whole bit, the restaurants you guys got there and everything. Uh, can you, you know, can you talk about bringing, you know, ice skates to the lake? Because yeah. a lot of these kids, are, you know, we can swim circles around people, but to uh, put some ice skates on some of our kids, it, it was a whole different story a few years ago. <laughs> Absolutely. And uh, yeah, it's something that we wanted to bring to Lake of the Ozarks to have a winter activity. As we know, we have shoulder seasons uh, here at the lake and uh, we want to keep the seasons continuing here. So, you know, we offer, uh, you know, our outdoor ice skating, which is the only outdoor ice skating rink in central Missouri. Um, so we offer skate lessons. We have uh, new skate guides this year that we have some great sponsors that have sponsored some new skate guides that, that normally you see in Rockefeller Center in Chicago. So there are going to be some really cool uh, cool skate guides this year that's going to be easier for those that don't know how to skate. Uh, you get behind these skate guides and you feel like an Olympia. And, and when you come into the facility there, you, you know, the, the parking lot's kind of up on the edge or the, the top. And uh, you guys have all the Christmas lights. And then you see the ice rink. And then you've got the, the restaurant behind you and stuff. And the, the fire pits and, and just the families all hanging out. It's a really neat atmosphere. You got the, you know, the music and everything going on. It just, you feel like you're you're just taken away somewhere. Yeah, you almost feel like you're in Colorado, uh, you know, with the fire pits and just the warm ambiance. You, you truly get a feel for like a Norman Rockwell kind of, Norman Rockwell kind of feel when you come through the resorts and you see the white lights and the horse-drawn carriage rides, the bonfires. And mainly, you know, we look for all the smiles and all of our guests. You know, we have so many repeat customers that are coming back uh, that are making memories, making memories here at Okinderhook. And that's what we want to continue to provide, a uh, family-friendly, uh, affordable uh, getaway in the wintertime for Lake of the Ozarks. As we're doing our part to try to bring more people to the Lake of the Ozarks. And that property really has grown over the last 20 years. I mean, it, it was nothing but fields and trees behind you. And, and uh, up, you know, now that we got this hotel and, uh, you know, you guys are putting a lot of people there uh, doing the tournaments, you know, the, the new home growth I see behind you, that new house they're building there. Yeah. Uh, you know, there's a lot of, of unique things going on on the property out there. Can, can you talk yeah. about some of the stuff? I mean, you guys got the spa and, and the restaurants. and. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, people think of Oak Kinderhook as a resort, but it's also a place to live. I mean, you can stay a day or forever here. We offer uh, some of the probably the cheapest HOA assessments here in Lake of the Ozarks. We're a golf cart community. A lot of our homeowners will uh, take golf carts to the uh, trophy room for dinner, breakfast, go to the spa, and then they go back to their uh, their homes in a golf cart. And they also uh, you can take their golf carts down to our marina. We have a boat ramp area located on the 12 mile marker on the Big Niagara. So our guests bring in boats. We have trailer parking. We have boat slips available uh, to get us connected to the Lake of the Ozarks a little bit better. Uh, but we, we've done a lot of new things with the trophy room restaurant. Uh, we've changed the menus up. We have a nice, giant Bavarian pretzel. Uh, a lot of the menu features by Chef Andy are just incredible. 
Uh, we launched a Sunday brunch now every Sunday from nine to one. You're gonna get all your eggs Benedict, your prime rib hash, a lot of great uh, fresh made uh, features there as well. And here recently in about four, about three months ago, we partnered with uh, Studio 54 um, and and they are now leasing uh, our spa. So we have Spa 54 here at Okinderhook. They also manage the Spa 54 at Camden on the Lake and they own a hair studio. Uh, in Eldon. So these guys have done a great job at the spa and uh, really revamped the whole spa look as well. So we got a little something for everybody out here, whether you're a golfer, skater, you just want to relax, you're going to go fishing. Um, it's just, it's just really incredible. I'm trying to offer something to everybody and not just be a golf resort. Now, when we talk about Lake of the Ozarks, there's a lot to the lake itself. You know, it goes all the way up uh, from Warsaw all the way down to uh, Bagnell Dam. And you guys are kind of on an uh, one of these tributaries, the, the Niangua, uh, that it's kind of a special landscape. And uh, you guys are kind of in these, these valleys tucked in, and then you have Haha Tonka, probably not, I don't know, four or five miles up, up river. Uh, but it's really a unique, a unique landscape in that area. Yeah, and you're close to everywhere. People realize we're here in Camdenton, just five minutes from the square. But you can be in Osage Beach and Lake Ozark in 20, 25 minutes, uh, easy right there. Um, but yeah, with Haha ha Tonka, you know, being voted number uh, four state park in the nation by USA Today is great to have nearby us. And then recently, they were, uh, Lake of the Ozarks was voted number two uh, fall foliage in the nation by USA Today. Uh, and then we had the rec and then the lake itself was voted number one recreational lake. So we have so many great accolades here in Lake of the Ozarks. Uh, to offer a little something for everybody and you know ha, ha tonka is truly amazing this time of year in the fall for uh tours we partner with one of our homeowners out here and uh, she does guided trail guided tours out at old kinderhook and she knows every trail she knows the accessibility for every person uh to really fit that person's need to really get out and enjoy some nature very neat well i, I appreciate the time you guys gave us today and a little uh little lesson on what's going on there and more is to come i guess is uh thanksgiving the the time when the ice skating rink yeah thanksgiving uh thanksgiving at one o'clock we open up our outdoor ice skating rink if you're still if people are still looking for uh reservations for thanksgiving i would give us a call i know we're up to over 350 on the books right now and then starting friday is when we kick off uh, friday the 29th is when we'll kick off all the uh, christmas festivities so santa claus will be here uh, a couple of days i visit our website at oldkinderhook.com and click on the tab uh, Christmas Village or ice skating and you can learn more about our winter activities uh, here at Oldkinderhook. Now, now, do you guys have ice skating, uh, or not ice skating, but uh, hockey leagues out there? Or how, how is that? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we, we offer a pond hockey leagues open to the public. Uh, you just come out. I think those are on Sundays, Tuesdays, and Thursday nights from 8 to 10. Uh, we're looking at possibly bringing back some broom ball, broom ball uh, game or um, you know, I chair the Lake of the Ozarks Food Bank Advisory Council. I'm looking at potentially putting on a, a broom ball tournament out here as well uh, on the ice. Uh, probably once we get into January and we'll start closing down the ice rink probably Mondays and Tuesdays. So I'm going to probably designate one of those days so we can have the ice for a, a fundraiser event. Well, very good. Good things to come out of Old Kinderhook. And uh, we thank you for your time. Hey, thank you, Sean. I appreciate your time and appreciate all you do here for Lake of the Ozarks.